now I'm going to look at uh, controlling Pico O gauge points with their motors but under digital control. So I'm using the Lens LS150 accessory decoder to control my point motor. I've wired up the point motor with the common returns and then left and right motors wired back to the, the terminals, the common in the middle and left and right on the plus and minuses. The Pico O gauge motor has location points for the um, point motor. The pin goes up through the, the, the slide bar there. And then there are the clip top of the clips which you can bend over to secure them onto the bottom of the, the track. You can also mount them using the, the mounting plates so that they're a distance away underneath the baseboard. Or you can mount them to the side using the PL12 adapter plates, which then link onto the end of the drawbar there. I will now program up the Lens LS150. I've got it connected to a 16 volt AC um, 3 amp transformer, don't use more than 3 amps. And it's connected to the track power J and K coming from the digital system to give it commands. In order to program it, you must have a point connected to the, the first outlet. So we'll press the programming button until the LED comes on, which is that. Go to our first point address and just move it across. That will now have programmed all six outlets uh, to consecutive addresses starting at the first address that you used. I'll just support this and... The Pico O gauge points are all electrofrog, which means that the, the frog here, the, the V section here, is actually contacting, so it can generate shorts. So they advise you, well, you, you must isolate these two rails with the insulated rail joiners. As it comes, that frog polarity is switched just by the contact of the tracks. So there are link wires underneath to the, the frog that connect that for polarity. They have a second option where you cut those link wires and open up there and drop in the PL33 micro switch which drops into this area here and as the tie bar goes across it operates the microwave micro switch changing the polarity. Uh, there is a wiring diagram with the point. Just be careful when you open it up not to dislodge this spring.